everybody welcome to the channel today we are out here in a place called the French Asylum you can see behind me we're in the endless mountains got the Toyota back there give me a second let me switch the camera around so this is the French Asylum or Asylum here in the middle of the uh, endless mountains in Pennsylvania looks like a nice little place to uh, scout around they got trails and buildings to explore um, I'm assuming that this is just probably some sort of French homestead uh, we haven't seen a billboard or anything we got a little donation box here sure to leave them a little uh, donation on the way out and just even the building at the entrance pretty cool so I'll make sure to lock the gate behind me and uh, Alicia's out here she already ran ahead of me I had to run to the truck looks like this says Wells cabin looks like a museum cabin Chase, what are you doing? Letting the dogs roam around in the grass. We're just out driving around and we came across this place and uh, decided to stop and check it out. We needed to stretch our legs. So, nice, beautiful homestead here. Assuming that all these buildings really have some age to it. Just look at the uh, construction. It's really something else. Over here, it looks like we got a bit of a wine cellar. Interesting. Beautiful spot out here in the mountains. I wouldn't mind calling it home. So it looks like they got a little bit of a nature trail. We'll take a hike and uh, we'll bring you back if we find anything else exciting. So we made our way over to uh, one of the larger main buildings. Oh yeah, certainly a groundhog. This looks to be the blacksmith shop. Yeah, I think Chase knows there's a groundhog there. He's freaking out. There's a little smokehouse, got some garages. And I believe I the normal. owners were the Laportes. I guess if it was open we would pay and then take a tour of all the buildings, but. Yeah. Yeah, I'm assuming that it's I've seen they had a wine cellar, so maybe they made wine. What a wonderful spot, though. Look at that, we got a fairy bell. Interesting. Boy, Chase is just tugging me right along. Eighteen thirty six. Okay. So that's the Laporte house. Very nice. I apologize for my unsteady hand. Chase is just tugging me away. Um, it is so nice here. 
Yeah. So driving out here, it was foggy and misty and rainy the whole way. Finally, we get out here and we get some sun. It's beautiful. Wagon house. Built in the mid 1800s, wow. Look at that though, built in 1794, the Queen's house, I don't yeah. know. Where the um, the bar and uh, restaurant is, with the um, the nice wall. Yeah, and yeah. Stuff. So the overlook, I believe, it's up over there. He said, right? Mm. There's an overlook. Alicia's nice. talking about when we came in. It's back over along the ridge there. You're actually looking down in this valley from the top of the mountains. We can see when we get back. Yeah. Oh, okay. One heck of a nice homestead here. those fields over there we took a look at them when we were coming in I think that's soybeans uh, that's a farm that's adjacent to it um, and get some corn over there too Okay, so that is the Laporte family French asylum. Just so everybody knows, I am not pronouncing it wrong. Asylum? Okay, that's going to be one last look. We're going to head on down the road. Hope you guys enjoyed this tiny little video. If you did, drop us a like. Subscribe if you want to see more. And we'll see you on the next one. Come on, Chase.